Hey, it's All Faces, it's Annie again. Today I am here with a haul of high-end makeup products that I've gotten from some different brands. I've got some Champagne in here, I've got some Clinique Makeup Forever, and also a prize that I won in um, a contest on one of my favorite blogs, and I want to tell you about it. So, I've got lots to talk about. Let's go. Okay, the first thing I got was the only makeup thing I asked for for Christmas, and it is this, and it's kind of like all jumbled up in there. It's the um, Best of Rock Forever by Makeup Forever. It's like a little, kind of a little taste of their products, and um, this is awesome. It's got all of these goodies in here. It's got a little um, sample of their HD powder, which is awesome. Very finely milled, and... I set my makeup with it today. Um, it also has a sample of their HD primer, which I use today, and it totally makes my skin really soft. Love it. Um, there is a hair in my eye. Okay. Um, then it has a little sample of their Sense Eyes. They're a little eye makeup remover. Right? Yeah waterproof eye makeup remover. Cool. And then, this is really why I asked for it. It's the Smoky Lash. And I absolutely love this. Um, it's got a bendy wand. So, how I use it is I just flip it with the bend out and then go like that. And I used it on my eyelashes today. And this is awesome. The color is great. Uh, the formulation is great. I haven't noticed um, that much flaking, but I wear my makeup for a long time, so eventually all mascaras flake. Sorry to let you in on that, but it's true. And then I also got a um, little kit. Also comes with the Makeup Forever Professional Aqua Eyes Eyeliner, which I've been wanting to try. Um, supposedly waterproof and I swatched it right here so it's a really nice black color really rich uh, works well on the waterline and also doesn't dry too quickly like you can still smudge it if you want to so that was really awesome and this set is actually part of the Sephora okay, sale. Next I want to talk about one of my friends that I've met through my blog originally and now she is also on YouTube and her name is Nicole and her blog is called Envy Beauty and she's really awesome um, she really keeps up with her blog unlike me kinda lazy with my blog but um, she's just started doing videos on YouTube and I will leave a link to her page in the down bar but um, she's awesome so go give her some love and subscribe to her because it will encourage her to make more videos. Um, anyways, so on her blog, she was doing a big giveaway, um, all different kinds of prizes and whatnot, and I was actually a winner, and I'm so excited. And what I won was a brand new flat iron, and it's right here. It's by Solia, and it is the Professional Ceramic Ion Flat Iron. So I got this and the actual flat iron, cut the crap on my desk, looks like this and I haven't used it yet but I'm so excited to use it, right here. So um, what I love about this is it actually has a little setting here so you can change the temperature of your flat iron, I mean seriously, this is awesome. So I'm really excited to use this, this is like I don't know, an $80 value or something, so that was like an extra Christmas present for me. Um, I got that, and then I also, with that, I got this, which is by Sidu, and it is an anti-frizz polishing treatment with argan oil, and the bottle looks like this. So far, I'm loving this. I haven't used a flat iron yet, but I have used this, and um, it's really helping with my frizz, like right here, I get a lot of frizzies right here so when I get out of the shower I'll really focus some of that here and on the ends just to kind of defrizz myself and loving this so I want to say thank you Nicole thank you so much this is so awesome 
and I can't wait to really dig in with that flat iron and really um, show you guys how that will turn out with this mop of mine. Thanks Nicole. So go check her out. Okay, next up, I have finally purchased, um, I think I talked about it, my favorites. I was testing out a new foundation, and it is this one right here. It's the Clinique Acne Solutions Foundation, and it comes in a bottle like this. It's really awesome. It has a squeezy tube, and... The color is like perfect. It blends easily. It's not instantly mattifying, which I can't stand that. Um, it has leaves a natural finish, and I really, really love this. I'm really glad that I tried it, and I will be using that for a while. I can't wait to see how that reacts with my skin during the summer because it's really working out well right now, and my skin is not as oily as it can be. Um, so I'm really excited to see how that works out but so far so good I'm loving it it has such a nice finish on the skin it doesn't feel like you're really caking on makeup and it also has salicylic acid so it prevents breakouts and helps with the ones that are occurring right now so yeah loving that and I'm so glad that I purchased the bottle okay then are the goodies that I got from Champagne. now let's talk Champagne for a second I was really excited for this collection to come out. And then it came out and I was a little let down. It's a little too frosty for me, the majority of the colors. I'm not a big frost person, so um, I ended up not buying a lot, but I think what I got were some of the winners of the collection. So let's get into it. Um, I got a paint pot. This is my first paint pot. And I bought vintage selection and it's a really pretty champagne color as you can see I've used it already I will swatch it here and see if you can see it it's just a lovely champagne color with some frost and a bit of sparkle but not overdoing it I actually used it as a base today on my eyelids and so far so good with this. I still use a primer because I'm I'm totally paranoid about like creasing. So I still use a primer, but it's working. So that's cool. Then I got um what is this? Uh eye coal in I get no kick. It's a frosty one. And it looks like this. Yet another champagne color. A little more on the gold side, as you can see. And this I've just been putting right here. I have it there today. Just to brighten up the inner corners of the eyes. And I can compare this one to... Um, where is it? I can compare this to my Illamasqua medium pencil in Hex, which is like more like the chromographic liners, which are like flesh tone. So I'll put it right underneath. So see, completely different. This is flesh toned um, Hex, and then that's I Get No Kick. So good. I didn't like double purchase the same type of thing. Um, and last but not least is my absolute favorite thing I bought, which is, um, another eye coal. And, oh, I'm sorry, it's a coal power eye pencil in feline. This is amazing. This is like the blackest eyeliner I've ever seen. It's right here. So we can compare this feline to the Make It Forever aqua eyes and you can see just the difference in the pigmentation and the depth oh my gosh this in the waterline does not move I love it I need to go buy another one love this um officially can't live without this best eyeliner I used it today 
and you can also use it with um, a 266 and just like get the, some liner on there and you can use it in place of a cream eyeliner. It's amazing. Amazing. You know what, while we're here, let me use um, a zero liner and I'm going to compare it to these two. So, we have got fascinating hair, zero in the middle, and then the makeup forever aqua eyes. And feline wins. Feline wins. Yay. <laughs> um, these are great. So feline you can smudge out. Zero. Doesn't smudge very well. And aqua eyes doesn't move now. <laughs> so it depends on what you're using your eyeliner for. Like if you want the smudgy look, if you want it to stay put, if you're going to be crying if you're going to be this or that or whatever. So you just need to find out what works for you. But I love feline. Two thumbs up definitely for me. So yeah, doll faces, that is my little high-end haul. I'd love to know what you guys got for Christmas or what you've been buying, what you got from Champagne. Um, leave it in the comments below or leave me a video response and let me know. And um, yeah, I think that's about it. I hope you have a great day, doll faces, and I'll see you soon. Bye!